Hi folks, welcome. What am I doing? Well, these are leftover pots from the last workshop. What I like to do with them is put them back into the box that the clay came in and I crush them down. Crush them down and for recycling, you know, for just one of those jobs we have to do, isn't it? What you don't want to do is recycle. Are we in a picture? Yeah. What you don't want to do is recycle, have a, a wet bucket and you're just continually putting lumps of clay into it. Don't do that. Wait for your, all your clay pots, lumps to dry out. You must dry them all out in the sun or by the stove. Get them completely dry. You see what I'm doing? So when it comes to just try and get them broken down, smallish, so there's not too many thick pieces, you know. So I think that's all of We just had a workshop this last weekend. So, so what we're gonna do then with those, put them into to a bucket, five gallon bucket, half fill it with water, put a little bit of vinegar in with it, a little white vinegar is what I do, about a half a cup per bucket. And then add these clay, clay shards into the water and fill it right up to the top. Leave them in there for a few days as long as you can, no rush, until you need it. And then you will you will get a nice even nice even consistency in the the recycle. If you don't do it like that, if you don't dry, don't bother to dry out your clay. So everything is starting from the same place of dryness, and you've got some that are leather hard and some that are more sloppy, you're going to find that they will all absorb the moisture at differing amounts. So you'll get a very lumpy, that's what I'm trying to say, you're going to have a very lumpy recycle clay body to deal with. So for a more even, consistent uh, recycled clay, make sure you start from dry. I hope that explains it. And um, yeah, I mean, I, I remember at home in the pottery working, we had a bucket under the table. All the wheel, all the stuff out of the wheels just went into that one bucket. When it got full, we took it all out and sort of tried to recycle it. But it was all a mixture of hard and soft, you know, which is not ideal, let's say. Okay, folks, hope that saved you a bit of time. Keep practicing, join us for a workshop here. We still have vacancies going through into the fall. And if you're interested in a leech treadle wheel, I'm taking orders for them. Contact me for details on that. If you want Zoom Clay, that's online live instruction commentary direct to your wheel head. Also get in touch with me for that. I'm mentioning this a little bit, you know, just to see if we get, I don't want to be spending too much time doing that, but I don't mind doing a few people, sort of, you know, on a semi-regular basis, just to, yeah, just to keep, keep the money flowing, you know, pay the bills. <laughs> yeah. Okay, folks, hey, thank you. Keep practicing. God bless. See you soon. Bye.